Hello all mathematics lovers, welcome back in another interesting mathematical episode. Today I am going to show you a very interesting way to multiply any two numbers. Let us consider a random number 7 which is multiplied by 28. What you have to do, consider the half of 7. Half of 7 means 3.5. Do not consider the fraction, consider the full number. That means you have to write here 3 and make double of 28. Double of 28 means 56. Make again half of 3, that means 1.5. Do not consider fraction, consider only the full number, which is 1. And make double of 56, which is 100 and 112. Now, what you have to do is just add these three numbers, this one, that one, and that one. 6 plus 2 is 8, 8 plus 8 is 16, 6 carries 1, 1 plus 1 is 2, 5 plus 2 is 7, 7 plus 2 is 9, and this one is here. That means 196 is the answer of 7 times 28. Is not it interesting? Well, let's make another example to make you clear. Let us consider 5 is multiplied by 32. Let's consider half of 5. Half of 5 means 2.5. We don't know to consider the uh, fractional number. Just write it 2 here. And make double of 32. Double of 32 means 64. And then half of 2 means it is 1. And double of 64 means 128. But in this case, something is different. Look, look at here. This is even number and this is even number. Whenever both of them are even number, they have to be out from our calculation. Look at here. This is odd even, odd even, odd even. So this part is calculated. This part is counted. In this case, only this part shall be removed from our consideration. So only add 128 plus 32. That means 8 plus 2 is 10. 3 plus 2 is 5 plus carry 1 is 6 and this is 1. That means 160 is the answer of 5 times 32, right? This is clear difference. Only whenever all even numbers should be removed from the system. That's the rules, nothing else. Let us consider another example. Let's say um, any random number, let's say 7 is multiplied by 21. Half of 7 means 3.5. As I told you, do not consider the fractional number, only consider the integer number. That means half of 7 is 3. Double is 21 means 42. Half of 3 means 1.5. We have to write 1. And double of 42 means 84. Now, add these three numbers. 21 plus 42 plus 84. 4 plus 2 is 6. 6 plus 1 is 7. And 8 plus 4 is 12. 12 plus 2 is 14. That means 147 is the answer of 7 times 21. This is interesting, right? <laughs> Let's make another example. Let's say 5 times 25. <clears throat> So what I say, make half of 5. Half of 5 means 2.5. Write only 2 here. No fractional, number, no fractional number is allowed here. Make double of 25 means 50. And half of 2 means it's 1. And double of 50 means 100. Same here. Look at here. This is even number and even number. All even number will be cancelled from our consideration. So add these two numbers. 100 plus 25 is 125 is the answer of this multiplication. 5 times 25. That means 5 times 25 is 125 according to this mathematical calculation and normal mathematical calculation as well. Is not it interesting? Well, um, let's make another example. 7 times 45. As I say, you have to consider half of this number. Half of this means 3.5 half of 7 means 3 and double of make double this number 45 of double means 90 and half of 3 means 1.5 write only 1 here double of 90 means 180 and add these three numbers together 180 plus 90 plus 45 which is equals to 315 yes 315 yes 315 is the answer of 7 times 45. Well, let's make another example, last example. Um, let's say a little bit bigger number. 15 times 28. 
let's make half of 15 half of 15 means 7 0.5 do not consider the fraction and double of 28 means 56 half of 7 means 3.5 we have to write 3 and double of 56 means 112 and half of 3 means 1.5 we have to write 1 and double of 112 means 224 add this right column numbers 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 6 is 12 12 plus 8 is 20 20 0 and carry is 2 2 plus 2 is 4 4 plus 1 is 5 5 plus 5 is 10 10 plus um, 2 is 12 2 is here and carry is 1 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 1 is 4 that means 420 is the answer of 15 times 28 well i have a bonus video for you I know a simple tricks and by using that tricks you can multiply this number within a very short time let's say 12 times 13 so you can multiply 12 times 13 by using these tricks so quickly so question is what is that tricks the tricks is very simple what you have to do is you have to add this number that means 12 with this 13 that means 12 plus 13 which is equals to 15 all right 15 here and then second step you have to multiply this second digit by that second digit that means 2 times 3 is 6 and this is the answer of this multiplication that means 12 times 13 is equal to 156 let's make another example let's say 13 times 13 apply the same tricks here add this number with that number last digit so 13 plus 3 which is equals to 16 write it here and multiply second digit by that second digit that means 3 times 3 which is equals to 9 yes 169 is the answer of 13 times 13 let's say uh, any random number 12 times 14 12 plus 4 which is equals to 16 write it here 16 2 times 4 is 8 yes 168 is the answer of 12 times 14 thank you so much for watching and i appreciate your support i hope you enjoy my videos and i request you to subscribe my channel and share these videos with your friend it will help me to make further better quality full content Thank you so much and see you next time. Bye-bye.